Are you wanting to step up the scheduling management system at your workplace? Workplace calendars are no joke. They're filled to the brim with internal and external meetings, lunch breaks, phone calls, you name it. When it comes to efficiency, you must have a system that makes your scheduling easy. This is where Calendly comes in. This scheduling tool gives you all the administrative support your company needs. I'm Sissy with Jotform, and in today's video, we'll be discussing the different plan options Calendly has to offer your company. Let's get into it. Calendly's entry level and cheapest option is the Calendly Basic Plan. Although its features are limited to the most basic tools, it is completely free. With the Basic Plan, you can connect one calendar per user and create only one type of event. Essentially, your event type is determined by the rules you put in place for your meetings, which is to say the duration, location, or time you're available for that meeting. Now, let's say you're a recruiter. If this were the case, then you'd want a different type of event for phone interviews than you would for department meetings. In this situation, BASIC is not ideal. When it comes to scheduling restrictions, however, BASIC doesn't enforce a limit on the number of events you can schedule. You can even utilize video conferencing with Zoom, GoToMeeting, and Microsoft Teams for free. Do note, though, that if you're wanting to add Calendly to your Salesforce workflow, you'll have to upgrade to a different plan. If you work with a smaller team and aren't looking to integrate with other tools, then the basic plan is a great option for you. And remember, it's free. All right, here's a rundown of the pros and cons you can expect from using Calendly's basic plan. Pros. It integrates with Zoom, Microsoft Teams, GoToMeeting, and Intercom. You can embed your website. You can automate notifications for new meetings and cancellations. And you can personalize your scheduling link. Cons. This plan doesn't include Zapier, Salesforce, or payment apps in its integrations. There aren't customized website add-ons, invites, or reminders and notifications. You can't use a pooled availability function for scheduling meetings with multiple people or group events. And there aren't any reporting functions or Google Analytics integrations included. If Calendly's basic plan didn't provide the appropriate amount of varying event types allowed with the plan, then the Essentials plan is for you. With Essentials, you can create unlimited event types. This plan comes in at $8 per month per user when you subscribe annually. Or if you choose the monthly billing option, it's $10 a month. Not only does this mid-priced option give you the benefit of unlimited meeting types, but you can also get two calendars per user. If you send invites from a personal calendar and a work calendar, then you'll want an Essentials account. This plan also includes a metrics and reporting function, which can come in handy when scheduling large events or when tracking leads. You'll also receive a pooled availability option with this plan. So if you're meeting with your whole team or a large number of participants, this function is essential. Calendly's Essentials plan does come with some integrations through the Zapier suite, but they don't include your common tools like HubSpot, Salesforce, or major payment apps. Essentially, if you're looking to use Calendly for scheduling group meetings easily, the Essentials plan is a perfect option. Plus, you get the bonus of customizing notifications and branding. All right, here are some of the pros and cons of the Calendly Essentials Plan. Pros, you can better support your group meetings and events with pooled availability and unlimited event type functions. You can remove the Calendly branding for your invites. You're given metrics to track leads and pull helpful reports organized by event type. And you can connect with hundreds of apps through Zapier. Cons, you don't get any customization when it comes to adding Calendly to your site. You can't access popular apps like HubSpot, MailChimp, Salesforce, or payment apps. There's no access to the live chat customer support function, and you don't have the features of automatically redirecting an invitee after they accept your meeting or event invitation. Moving on, if you want the most comprehensive plan that Calendly has to offer, look no further than their pro plan. It's priced out at $12 per user per month if you choose to bill annually. If you want to pay per month, it'll cost $15 instead. If you use Salesforce or HubSpot, the Pro Plan supports all integrations. One of Calendly Pro's top features is its workflow tool. 
It streamlines your workflow by allowing you to send automated messages to your attendees, including agendas, follow-up messages, or post-meeting notes. This feature helps your team properly prepare for meetings, as well as keep them organized. Full customization can be reached with the Pro Plan, as well as SMS notification capabilities and integrations with Google Analytics. But this only comes into play if the included metrics and reporting aren't quite cutting it. If your company is on the larger side, Pro is probably the best option for you. Your larger scale events and meetings will benefit from Pro's payment options and other essential platform integrations. Here's a comprehensive look at the Pro Plan's pros and cons. Pros, all major integrations like Salesforce, HubSpot, Google Analytics, MailChimp, Stripe, PayPal are all included. You can utilize SMS notifications and invitee redirection. You can add workflows and customizable meeting automation. And while you're customizing, you can also completely customize your Calendly website add-on. Also, Pro is the only plan that allows for payments and certain essential integrations. Cons, the most expensive plan Calendly offers. It could potentially have more features than necessary for your company. Live chat is available, but only if your account has over 10 users on it. But if none of the three Calendly plans feel like a good fit, you've always got Jotform. You can easily schedule appointments with Jotform's appointment fields, which is found in our form builder. This simple tool lets attendees choose the time that works best for them out of a pre-selected list. You can even set parameters on how long or often you'd like to set a meeting. Jotform also has a convenient calendar view function in Jotform tables. This way, you can easily see each appointment labeled with the name of the respondent and the appropriate date and time. It also updates in real time, so you always know you're looking at the most up-to-date schedule. You can even integrate the G Suite with Jotform's Google Calendar integration to sync all your appointments automatically. At the end of the day, no matter what size your company is, the type of integrations you use or how often you book appointments or schedule events, there is a Calendly plan option for you. Let's review. There's the basic plan, which is completely free and includes all of Calendly's base functions. Zero frills for zero dollars. Then there's the essentials plan, which costs $8 per month per user and allows unlimited event types, provides metrics, and integrations with Zapier. Then we have the pro plan. It's $12 per month per user and allows all major integrations, customizations, and SMS notifications. And if all else fails, you can also use Jotform as an alternative to Calendly. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Sissy with Jotform, and I'll see you next time.